Honeymoon is experiencing those who report feelings of immense dread, followed by the sensation of being followed or pursued. <laughs> Dorsha will deliver what Richard seeks. There is no going back from deliverance. Dorsha is otherwise harmless to humans it does not seek. Great. <laughs> Except to be sought by Dorsha is to be found by Dorsa. If you want your loved ones to show by Dorsa, it's fucking over. It's over. It's done. Grieve and find peace through acceptance. Thank you, Home Health Safety Hotline. What bushes? Why do you keep talking about bushes? Bushes are on fire because snakes hide in bushes. Why are you obsessed with snakes all of a sudden? I'm a hiker. I'm always obsessed with snakes. Listen to me, my dude. You have no reason to fear snakes. That's not true. Uh, you guys ready? I mean, you're kind. You're kind of right, but you're kind of wrong. Are you guys good? You guys good to go here? No. Yes. You guys good with the snakes and everything? Snakes on the plane? You see, if I weren't walking in the wilderness, I wouldn't have to worry about them. But if I accidentally come across one hiding in a bush, it can't attack me. Don't That's walk in the wilderness. How about that? No. It's, it's got to. No. House fires? Yeah. It's invigorating. Okay. Flooding. Uh, yeah, I guess black mold is kind of scary. Uh, okay, okay. Metamorphosis, yes. Yeah, that'll, that'll, is that'll, the music supposed to cut out? Or? I think, I think so. Oh, okay. I just make sure. Oh, Discord? No, no, thank you. Uh, let's check the um, options. Okay. Do we like the CRT, CRT filter? CRT filter. Use yes, dyslexia font? That's funny. Uh, ooh. <gasps> ooh. What's that screen resolution, dude? Uh, I don't know. It seems like it's like that for a reason. At least I'm gonna put it at 60 hertz. Oh god, it just shrunk. Oh. It just shrunk it. Fucked up. Yeah, I really did. Alright. I really screwed the pooch. It's fine. Control the volume of sounds that will enter my ears. Thank you, game. <laughs> I like that. Uh, okay, let's see. Uh, do you guys have arachnophobia? Oh. Entomophobia? Nyctophobia? Trip. A trip. I thought this was supposed to be tryptophobia. Tripo. Pop. Tripophobia. Tripophobia. Scopophobia. Claustrophobia. And sinophobia. Huh. I didn't know this one, actually. The rest of, the rest of these I kind of do, but. Sino? No, this, is, this has to be kinophobia because it's canine. No. Right? No. So, I don't know. Okay. Don't know. Whatever. Man, this game is looking worse for wear since I messed with the options. Hold on. Oh, you, you messed with it too hard. I I messed with it way too hard, my dude. Okay, let's. Woo. T20 by 1080. Hey, you go. Now we're talking. Can actually see. Now I can actually see what's going on. All right. Uh, credits. Home safety hotline. Okay, let's check our mailbox here. Welcome. Welcome. You've got mail. Yeah, it's sinophobia. Nice. Carol Carol Regina. She'll be calling you today every from your duties and will be rolling your work daily to ensure maximum accuracy. Responders with a ninety percent accuracy rate or more will be qualified to receive our daily employee coupon. That sounds coupons. That sounds invigorating. Due to an error, error with an archival network, some of you may notice videos files from our video archive appearing on your desktops. Okay. Ignore the random weird file that just appears on your desktop, I guess. Oh no, Monday. I hate Mondays. This game is kind of loud, but... Oh. Being shift, please clock in below. Done. Bed bugs. Bed bugs. Disgusting. Yeah. Small insects known for feeding on the blood humans. Okay. Majority of common pesticides that are therefore quite difficult to remove. HSH oh, yeah. pest removal services. Yeah, you actually have to like 
not only really mess up to get bed bugs, you actually have to. Hello. Welcome to Home Safety Hotline, new employee. My name is Carol, and I'll be acting as your supervisor during your time here at HSH. Okay. Before you begin your first day here, let me tell you a bit about how things work here. You are an HSH responder. As such, it is your job to learn about various household hazards so you can answer the questions of our callers intelligently. When a client calls, yes, answer office. the call and listen carefully to their concerns. When you've diagnosed their issue, submit the corresponding household hazard and we'll forward them safety instructions to address their problem. Welcome to the HSH family. I'm sure we'll talk again soon. Okay. This is peeving me out because it rem reminds me of my days working at a call center. Oh, I feel so sorry for you. Yeah, dude, it wasn't it wasn't good. Carpenter ants. Okay. Cockroaches. These are real pests. Mm -hmm. Resilient and fast breeders. Hello. John here. My wife insisted I call this number. It sounds like she thinks we might have some kind of infestation. My wife keeps telling me about specks of dirt or something in the kitchen just looks like coffee to me i don't know you tell me i guess okay johnny okay i'll tell you what i got these got a skin walker roaches i'm gonna guess it's black mold it's roaches dude he said black mold no he said black thing that looks like yeah. coffee grounds that's roach that's poo specks of dirt or something in the kitchen okay so then we look at cockroaches Coffee grounds. Yes. Okay, so then cockroaches, right? Looks like coffee. Correct the moon Um cockroaches. And cockroaches are absolute nightmare to get rid of. Yeah. D depending. Depending on how bad yeah. the infestation if, is, but if if they're German cockroaches, good luck. A gopher. Hey, they're little cute ones. Going. Okay. See the time. Hmm. Hi, I'm so sorry. My name is Grace, and it's probably nothing, but I thought I'd call just in case. Lately, I can't sleep at night because of this annoying little sound coming from my attic. Uh, it sounds kind of like, e e e mm -hmm. e e you know? It's, <laughs> yeah. It's probably nothing. I'm sure it could just be regular old house noises, but it's clearly a I raccoon. Just thought I'd call to ask and make sure. Holy raccoon. We love Alex. Please hold. Uh, mice? Question mark? Oh, we're gonna assume this. <laughs> mice are small waffles rodents, yeah. Uh, yeah, it could be the sounds of squeaking. Is there anything else? A raccoon? Like Willie was saying? Yeah. Ah, nest and attics. I think he's right. <laughs> yeah, but they're not attic. mentioning... <laughs> Why not squeaky sounds? Yeah. are really squeak. I think it's the mice. She did mention attic, though. The entry has nothing to do with. Uh, doesn't say anything about attic and that thing. I'm I'm going very visually about what the description says. Yeah, it doesn't oh. say where the mice could be though. Yeah. It could be anywhere. Okay. So we got termites, which typically don't oh, yeah. don't make noise. Ticks don't make noise either. Thank God. Okay, so we have yeah. the hard guess between raccoon and mice. I'm liable to I'm say raccoon. Mice. I'd say it's mice. Okay. All right. I'm going to go with mice. I don't think... Wait, play the audio sample. That's definitely a squeak. Now let's hear the raccoon one. And it has nothing. Okay, yeah, we're, go we're going yeah, mice then. Some mice. Really nice. Well, it could also be a bowl. Um, <laughs> they love climbing that. Yeah, they definitely love ele elevation, and they're definitely not completely blind. Can I even calling a hotline because of a house spider? Uh, I can. Hey, yes. Last week I called your guys about some crap in my yard. I was told, 
wasn't anything to worry about. Well, guess what? There's more piles of crap in my yard. Okay. I'm talking huge piles of brown out there. <laughs> you better not tell me it's nothing again, because I know I've seen something moving out there. Tell me what it is so I can take care of it once and for all. Okay. Well, he's got termites. Please hold. <laughs> huge termites. It could also be a raccoon. It could be a raccoon, but he's talking about actual crap, right? So... It's not about piles in the yard. Yeah, piles like of I don't think it's gophers. <laughs> it's a house spider. N that would be so funny. <laughs> it's yeah. flying. Uh, mole then? It has to be a mole, right? Volcano shaped oh, okay. mounds? They're known to eat insects? That's what I would think. What do you mean, warning never kill a mole? You never kill a mole. Kind of extreme. Um, okay. So we only have, it can only be one of two things. I'm not feeling the raccoon pick. Oh, it's not a raccoon. Okay, I'm feeling either mole or gopher. What, what do you guys think? Yeah, that's a hard one. I don't, I think based on the description, it's, gonna it's gonna be on the mole. Because the mole living in deep burrows look like volcano ship mounds and they're known to eat insects. Mm -hmm. That the insects part is whatever. But um, I'm worried about this warning never kill a mole thing. Whatever. Stop the mole queen. Break the pact. Piles of crap in my yard. Huge piles of brown. Okay, I'm gonna go with mole because the yeah, yep. I'm gonna go with mole. The other one has, doesn't say anything about piles of no, like no. mounds or anything. There we go. You do. Have a good day, Hank. Enjoy your fun with, you know, the moles. So you gotta check your desktop and see if random videos are popping up there, bro. I'm gonna wait until my shift is over, question mark. Oh, hello. Uh, um, quick segment here. Just calling to inform you that uh, your refrigerator's been running loud over here for the past 45 to 90 minutes. It's been running wild. <laughs> Better head on over and catch it, big fella. Um, the warning. That's not how that works. Oh, that's the pause button. Okay. Uh, no, we don't want to no, lose no. progress. Okay. Uh, thanks, Twig Sigmund, for fucking up that joke. Mm -hmm. Was the entry safe for? Oh, Damn. Hey, you guys have a lawn mowing service or something? My good-for-nothing kid refuses to mow, and it's getting real crazy out there. Looking like a rainforest over here. My kid is complaining about being too sick to do anything about it. Meh, 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 meh. Jesus, dude. Stupid lawns give me a headache just thinking about it. I guys, refuse to believe this guy's a home. This guy looks like a homeless man. Mm-hmm. Well, that's obviously ticks. Uh, yeah. it could be. I don't think black mold Please exists hold. in the garden. Um, yeah, it's, this is an interesting call because I don't know if I want to, yeah, because I don't, I feel like I just want to report this man to, uh, Child Protective <laughs> Services. <laughs> it could be ticks. Ticks typically it's make you, problem. yeah. Yeah, see right here, it says by keeping a tidy weed-free lawn, so it's definitely going to be ticks. The kid obviously has some sort of Lyme disease, question mark, and he's sick, and this is the worst dad that's ever lived, so. Any objections to that? <laughs> he's sending no. the fake ones so the kid <laughs> dies as punishment. <laughs> I don't, he's the, the victim in this, Willie. The, the dad is the one that, that should be dying. And sometimes the victims have to suffer. Okay, okay. We'll, we'll, we'll come so back to that one. <laughs> perpetrators can suffer more. Sometimes the the innocent must suffer. It, it says Willie. Got it. Sometimes. Sometimes. Or all times. Is that what you were saying? Sometimes. Oh, okay.
What do you mean human <laughs> DNA? <laughs> Hello? Human DNA check? Hello? <laughs> what? Uh, you hit your job. You are an endangered jerrier. Quit today before it's too late. You don't know enough. It's not late to put truly. Okay, whatever. You're high active. Daily coupon. Nice. That's right. Type the following code during your online checkout. Buzz off. Oh, dude. This is the worst. <laughs> Mm -hmm. This is the worst spray bottle I've ever seen in my life. Well, yeah. <laughs> what is the point? Okay. It looks like an AI generated bottle. Yeah. Kind of. All right. I don't see anything else. This is the same television commercial. So 1996, my dude. No wonder this is a horror game. Got four more years till Y2K just makes everybody collectively lose their minds. And then nothing happens. Well, nothing happened because of the tireless efforts of the coders. Mm, yeah, 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 yeah. They didn't get thanked at all. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, let's see. Nope, nothing's changed. Cryptic messages in my mailbox telling me to quit my job probably would go a long way. Who needs them? Guess not me. Hi, Carol. It's Carol again, your supervisor. I'm calling to let you know that you have been granted access to additional household hazard information. Thanks. Please be aware that this information is confidential and not to be shared with anyone outside of HSH. Okay. If you diagnose one of these hazards, we will be providing only information to the clients that is pertinent to addressing their concerns. Nothing more. Thank you. Okay. You're welcome, Carol. Thanks, Carol. Bye, Carol. Help me to HR, please. Carbon monoxide cellar growth? What the fuck? Mm. Oh. Ooh. Uh, okay. Common hob? Yo, hold on. Hold on. I'm doing some research here, boy. Oh, hi, Mike. anything I can do to... <laughs> Sorry. Uh, anything you can do to uh, prevent pollen from coming in the house? I think there's something seriously wrong with my ventilation or something because okay. I cannot stop sneezing. Uh, in the past, I haven't had problems so long as I've stayed inside, but I think something is getting in. Okay. Please hold. Oh, that's black mold. Uh, oh man, we got a lot of stuff going on here. Hold on. <laughs> we got a house fire. <laughs> uh, Jesus, what is a stair slug? Okay, first of all, let's bed teeth. Bed teeth, huh? Okay, let's start with let's start with what it could be that we know off the top of our head before we go anywhere. First of all, let's check that cellar grills. No, I don't think so. Toxic smog. Okay, that's not it. Uh, common hob. It'd probably be the um... oh, hob. Yeah, it's like a cobalt. Let's try a false beat. Ooh. Okay. Nope. Yeah, I don't think it's a symbiotic plant. Uh, nope. I mean, it's probably a black mold. Frozen pipes. He could be right. Hold on. Let's just check the house flying, because some people are allergic to flies. Nope. No. Right, let's try the pipe growth. He mentioned that it was coming in. Uh, he recently he would be okay. He used to be okay indoors, and then all of a sudden that changed. Yeah. So it can't be something from outside. It's got to be inside. Mm -hmm. So I can only think of like mold, because mold makes people cough and sneeze and stuff. All right, we're gonna do mold then. Let's take a look. There could be bed teeth. <laughs> could be bed teeth. Allergic reactions or breathing problems. Uh, so yeah, th that seems like our best bet. Best bet. Let's just check bed teeth real quick. Household fungus. Ew. Yeah. Okay. So what? Black mold, right? Yeah. yeah it's it's got to be black mold. Okay. We're gonna do black mold. You got some mold issues in your house, bro. You did it. 
I can't wait to answer one of these calls and then it's just somebody screaming at me. Like a real call center job. Yeah. Mm, look at that little boy. Yeah, look at him. Hey, hey clippings. Hmm. Do you know if there's such a thing as house saves that clean? Like, maybe to disguise hmm. the robbery? At night, I keep hearing all this noise coming from my living room, but when I go look at it, I find the place spotless. But haven't yet found anything missing. I've talked with the cops, mm -hmm. but they keep telling me to call this number. So here I am. Is there something you can do? Uh, I think this is going to be one of those whole mobs. Yeah, supernatural thing. Yeah. Uh, so common hobs. Let's see. Consume dust, dirt, and common sticky substances found on floor dishes, cleaning them in the process. Yeah. Only come out. Uh, let me just compare it to the desk hob real quick, which probably not. Nah, it's just she's just talking about like overall like a house living room, yeah, cleansiness. Yeah, yeah. Right. Okay. I don't think it could be any one of the other one of these, right? So. No. Nah, All right. So we're so we're gonna go with common hob. Yeah. Wait, what's the solution in the common hub? Yeah. Oh, you can't get rid of them. Yeah. Um, don't don't oh, provoke metamorphosis. Them, <laughs> don't provoke metamorphosis is what that thing just said. So uh, that's the second time I've seen that uh, in the hob description. So we're so pissing off. I just metamorphoses you. <laughs> Turns into some sort of monster more than it already um, is. It sounds like so. This is a fake call center because there is a huge weight between calls. Yeah, you're right. It definitely wasn't like that. Hi, Buzz Goober is a great name. Hi, Buzz Goober. <laughs> Oh my god. Just all over the place I got these whippersnappers yelping and whining and I can't get a wink of sleep. She's trying to lay down over here. What you gonna do about all this? Called about 5,500 times and y'all haven't done a thing about it. Okay, so there was this weird noise in, in there somewhere. Oh. That wasn't even one. It was just, he just. No, oh, okay. anytime the photos are all fucked up, they're just calling to fuck with you. Okay. I was ready to help that man too. I, I kind of feel a little bit betrayed. Audio sample. I don't know. Sound no like no common thing. No. It sounds like a T Rex. I, I don't know what's going on inside my house. Okay. I hear something crawling in the walls. Uh huh. I think I found teeth marks mm. on my bedposts. I can't sleep at night knowing there's something in my house. Help me, please. Okay. So in the walls, but also teeth marks on bedposts. Please. Uh, oh, all right. So no. let's look look at the bed teeth first of all. No, I don't think so. No. Okay. Um. So it's gonna be one of the hobs then, or a growth. Or mice. Or mice, okay. Yeah, mice make them. Could be a carpenter. You chew on wood. Carpenter, carpenter and? Yeah, let's take a look. Uh huh. Well, it could also be bed teeth, but I don't think. I think that's just fungus, not necessarily teeth marks in beds. Um, the thing that can that confuses me is that she's describing it as teeth marks. I would 100% believe it's carpenter ants based on the fact that this thing is saying wall in their wall. Yeah. Um, well, let's see some other stuff. Yeah, okay. So I'm thinking like the pipe family over here. Uh, like you go to mice real quick. Yeah. Yeah, it's the gnaw marks. 
that I'm thinking of, but she's not hearing squeaking. Yeah, you know. and also, um, she didn't mention it. This doesn't mention anything about the walls or in the no. walls. Uh, so pipe pump. Let's check the pipe growth first. Uh, yeah, that's not going to help us. Pipe pump. I don't think it's a pipe pump. Mm. Yeah, I don't think it is. I'm feeling it's carpenter ant. Unless there's something else uh you guys think of. It could what about the termites? But termites don't bite. No. This makes no mention of uh you know, any anything in the walls. It's it's gotta be carpenter ants then. Yeah. Yeah, I'd say put the Oh, yeah, I'm feeling it. Unless it's getting its carbon monoxide. <laughs> whole ass oh, bat. Shit. A bat. A whole bat. Okay. Um. So. Carbon... Wait, wait, wait. What, what is that danger? They're commonly have associated with ones above the soil. What? Uh, mm -hmm. with the ones above the soil. <laughs> okay. What? Where, I'm gonna I'm gonna come back to that. <laughs> okay, so carpenter heads, right? It can't be anything else. Yeah, nothing else is pretty conclusive. So let's just. I think bed teeth is the red herrings. Bed and teeth. Yeah. And teeth marks. We should read the description. It's kind of to do with it. Yeah, it's the crawling in the walls that kind of got me for the carpenter ants because obviously, if a carpenter ant gets to your bedpost, it's gonna look like teeth marks. Yeah. If enough of them are chewing on the bedpost. Get that pest service in. Hmm. Yeah, hey, I'm calling about a noise I've been hearing in my house lately. Sounds like scratching or something. It's real quiet. So definitely some kind of pest in my walls. I've set out all kinds of traps, but uh, I thought one worked for a while, but then I started hearing it again this week. I thankfully haven't seen any visible damage or droppings or whatever. That's kind of vague, my dude. Please yeah. hold. Uh, okay, again, there's something in the walls. No, something in their house. No, no, something in the walls. All right, so he hasn't seen any visible damage or droppings but there's something in the walls it's in the walls it's in the goddamn walls okay hmm what was the last thing he said can you spell that no damage or droppings what the fuck, dude? It's too vague. Yeah. Hmm, this is a rough one. It could be... No, this makes no message that mention of anything in the walls. Let's see. Whew, this one's a doozy, dude. Mm. Mm. All right, I think we're gonna have to just guess. What was this issue again? So, um, scratching in the walls. No, tr oh, no, no I'm damage or dropping audio samples of stuff. All right. No, nah, it wouldn't be cool. this scratching. Yeah, but it says sightings of small dried pellet droppings. Just hit the audio. Mm -hmm. Next one. 
Bees? Could actually be bees in the wall. Could be. Yeah. They obey their queen. I love this sentence. <laughs> um, I'm feeling carpenter ants again, but... It can't be carpenter ants twice. Can't play. Could be. I feel like it could be carpenter ants twice, and I'll tell you why. Ants typically don't leave waste around. Mm. I might have to go. Yeah, I might have to agree with you. I think it's. Uh, oh, hold on. We didn't check cockroaches. Oh, right now, same thing. Go to left stuff. Is there a wool hub? Yeah, I'm gonna go with carpenter ants again. Uh, I don't see what else it could be. Fracture hub again? Fracture hub? Yeah, let's see. Read what it says. Into cold cracks in the walls. No, I don't think it's that. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna do uh, carpenter ants then. Unless, no, can't be anything else, really. At least not from our limited amount of uh, entries. Mm. Either one of the two was wrong. Yeah. It could just be a red herring, though. It could be a, a misdirection. Could be. Could have been termites, actually. Uh, it might have been termites. I think it was termites. Uh, actually, all the descriptions here kind of don't fit with it because they're peeling paint small holes in the drywall. Dude, chill. Please hold. Dude, chill. You should be thanking Bob. Yeah, you need to organize better and leave Bob alone. Uh, breaking into his house, huh? It's gonna be one of the hobs, I think. Yeah, it sounds like a desk hob. Just from the organization thing. Yeah. Yeah, we'll frequently sort and order materials yeah. and a desk to their liking. Yeah, I think we're gonna do that. It can't be, it has to be one of these hobs. And this is the only one that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Through my papers, organization skills. Mm, let me just compare it to the common hob real quick. Yeah, yeah these, these ones just eat. Um, Nothing about... That's hob organizers. All right. yeah. That's hob it is. <clears throat> And dude, Dan, chill out, dude. Leave Bob alone. Bob from accounting's got other stuff going on, dude. Come on. Thank you. I don't think I would, could get paid enough to do this job. Oh, we got another movie. Let's check the mailbox first. Um, give me access to more. If you, I warned you, if you end up like me, join me in this hole. This hole right here, dude. It's safe in there. Thank you, Mike three at ssh.mail. I'm glad that you showed me your special secret panic hole. I guess it was very kind of him to at least try. Yeah, at least he's trying. Give me a way out. Network errors over the first next few days. Uh, studying your information and choose account freely while you still have access in case the network goes down. We're on the phone with the account. Oh, thank you. Mm. That's gonna be terrible. I don't think we did box, we got no coupon. Yeah, I think you're right. Real estate, it's free real estate. Real estate implies the existence of fake estate. <sighs> This is, seems like the kind of game for it. $84,000 for this? Not bad. $104,000 for this? That's terrible. The other one had a detached garage, my dude. Things are just getting worse and worse. Do 
civil authority has issued a missing persons alert for the following counties. Bush County, Maple County, Parkway County, Barry County. 89,000 for that? No way, dude. <laughs> Get out of my way. Get out of my face. You're cool right now. Get out of my face, dude. Wait, twelve thousand dollars for this? Hello? <laughs> oh, there's gotta be something wrong with this. One. Yeah, I can see there's something wrong. I can see that there's something wrong with this shit, dude. Look at it. It's like it's covered in vines. It's covered in overgrowth or whatever. All right. I guess we better have to buy a house that is very obviously tree and domain. Yeah. I don't want to bargain with tree spirits, actually. Mm -hmm. I know that sounds a little callous and a little um, stuck up with me, but I just refuse to. I, I refuse to communicate or talk to the Fae. Like, I don't want anything to do with them. Yeah, it's probably a good idea now with the Fae. No, I just don't want anything new. And that's just me personally. This is how I was raised. I don't want anything to do with fairies. Or fae. You know, technically a Wendigo is a fairy. Because it's a... I forget yeah. what the reasoning was, but it's like a tree spirit or something. Or forest spirit. Hello, Supervisor Carol here again. We've updated your permissions. You should now have access to more extensive information to work with for your future calls. Please be sure to read these new entries carefully so you can continue providing our clients with accurate diagnoses. Okay, Carol. Please remember that this information is strictly confidential and not to be shared with anyone unless pertinent to a caller's needs. Thank you, Carol. Thank you. I will try to remember that. Boggart. Oh. That's, oh. Not, that's not what I remember to bar it. Oh, it's a... Oh, yeah, okay. That makes sense. They're the um, metamorphosed versions of Hobbs. Mm. Oh, they're extremely dangerous to humans and pets, huh? There's something in the basement. I've seen it. It's huge. All of I think that's a bogger on. lady. It doesn't hiss or growl or anything, but I haven't gotten close enough to it to find out what it is since it's always just lurking out of sight from the top of the stairs. I need someone to come get this thing out of my basement as soon as possible. I've locked the door since I can still hear the steps creaking under its weight down there. Okay. Please hold. Uh, hold on, let's look at the rest of our options. False artifact. Nah, that's fine. It's not going to be that. What do you mean a false? Oh, that's got feet on it. <laughs> Look at him go. Okay. Uh, lamp spray. <laughs> this dude looks like a wily e. coyote accident. Eh, it's not that. Them go. Memory wisp. Audio sample private is incorrect. The issue will be corrected by the end of the month. What do you mean? All right. Miram nymph. Uh, okay. Whatever. Uh, fatal fey flu? That's funny. Oh, what the hell is all this? Okay, uh, toilet hob. Dude. Come on. Stay out of the toilet. Mm. Huh. Okay. Look at that dog. Out. It ain't that. Whistling fungi. Okay. Uh, wine sprite. <laughs> that is one drunk ass fairy. Mm. All right. The only thing I can think of is that it's it's, it's the, the bogger. It's the stair. It's the stair thing. What stair thing? The stair slug. Uh, let's take a look at the stairs. Like you might be right, actually. Uh, here's. Look at the size of that boy. Yeah, it's a dog size. Yeah. 
Almost as big as your dog. Okay. But they, he didn't say, um... It's always lurking just out of sight from the top of the stairs. It's lurking. I don't think a slug is capable of doing that. Yeah, you get some rinse and slime. Yeah. Yeah. Let's take a look. Uh, size of your dog. Okay. So boggarts are huge, right? Yeah, they're as big as yeah, a human. They're way too big. So, uh, way too big. I, I just gotta be the fucking slug. And, uh, it may very well be. But be a slug. Yeah, I think you guys are right. I think we're gonna go with stair slug and then, you know, die. <laughs> it's a house fight. <laughs> house fire. I, I love how people would have to like point that out to you. It's like, oh my god, what is this strange energy radiating inside of my house? It hurts and it's warm. <laughs> uh, okay, so we were going stair slug, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, commonly in basements, so I think that's right. Star mm, slug, star slug. What do you mean? I just want to close it, bro. Denied. You know? Damn it. Okay. I guess it was termites. Though. I guess it was termites, but termites are typically like quiet, right? Maybe not. I guess these ones up. I don't know. No, I don't even remember who that chick was, to be honest with you. Was she the one we said uh, carpenter ants? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, almost something else. Oh, you think it was mice? It could have been. How the fuck would mice be chewing it's on. The nine. They chew on wood. All right. Let me check this mice one again. Oh, never mind. No marks. Uh, yeah. Hey, uh, I've been hearing some really weird noises coming from the bathroom faucet recently. I'm not sure what it could mean. It just makes this nasty sound anytime I run it, along with this uh, nasty smell. Okay. Please hold. Uh, nasty smell, huh? Let's see. We have pipe growth. Okay, let's try pipe growth. Does it mention anything about a smell? Mm. What about frozen pipe? Uh, yeah, let's take a look actually. Frozen pipe, frozen pipe, up. Yeah, frozen pipes. I'm stupid. Did I? I'm stupid. Mm -hmm. Here it is. Faucet smells. Yeah, it's got to be frozen pipes. It's a common one. Yeah. Sam? Yeah. The smell is what was tipping me off, so. Here we go. Is it really mice for that one lady? I don't know. I don't know. I guess it had to. Have been. I, don't Dude, I don't know. Just because she mentioned teeth marks on her bedpost. Yeah, but what else could have been? my wife, I can't. Her face, it's gone. Mm. It's gone. My wife, I can't see her face. I can't see her face. Mm hmm. Uh, okay. Please. Oh, I got the wrong number, buddy. Yeah, you got the wrong number, dude. You need a psychologist. Um. Can you nice. go to, um, carbon monoxide poison? Yeah. <laughs> Let's take a look. Mm, none of this. No. Okay, so it's gotta be something supernatural. Uh, geez. 
Okay, let's start with the ones that make the most sense. Raccoons. No, oh, I know. <laughs> yeah. Oh, how about memory wisp? Memory. Due to a clear error, they right here. The ability to remember the faces of loved ones. Yeah, because she he said his wife is dead, so it can't be a mirror spread. Yeah. Okay. I love the solution. There's no need for further action. Yeah, once it's done, it's done. Oh. Memory wisp, right? It's um mm -hmm. I don't know what else it could be. He's talking specifically about their faces, so also, the solution? There is no solution. <laughs> they will eventually steal your memories and then they will go away. Jesus. Give me a second here. I'm trying to read about nymphs. Whoa. Hey, yeah, name's Fred Pinball. I'm calling to lodge a complaint against your place of business. I have never seen such a big old mess left behind by your pest control team. Just tons of twigs, sticks, and pebbles. Sod, and I ain't putting up with it no more. Okay. I got sawdust coming out of my drawers here. I had to grab you by the goober and smack mm -hmm. you around till next <laughs> Sunday. Now, what you gonna do? What you gonna do to make this right? Go away, dude. Go away, Fred Pinball. You're not intimidating me with your weird goober talk. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Disgusting. Very disgusting. Almost as, almost, almost as bad as bed bugs. Are growing nasty sharp things on bed them, teeth. and my legs itch like crazy. That's bed teeth. Do I need to be showering more often or something? I usually shower like once a week for my skin health. So oh my god. That's it. <laughs> god, it's living like a medieval peasant. My dude. Please hold. I got your problems right here. You need. Oh. Network. Yeah, uh, well, we already know. Yeah, it's just... not a big deal. Hold on, I gotta feed my bird real quick. She's going crazy. She, yeah, bed bug. She doesn't like that I'm just sitting here. What the fuck? Give me a second. Oh, hello. hello. I was told to call this number to ask about my problem. The wall in my bedroom doesn't look right near the bottom. The bottom of the wall has some cracks or maybe the fracture hub. Healing? I'm not sure. I have a cat named Whiskers, and sometimes he likes to sharpen his claws at the couch, but he would never do that to the wall. Okay, Wanda. He knows just how naughty that would be. Yeah? He's capable of... Really, really capable of such things. He's capable of cognitive thought like that, huh, with, huh Wanda? Okay, Wanda. Please, hold. All right, um... No concept of guilt, so... We're on our own here. Uh, try clicking again. We'll probably bring him back. Oh, yeah, you're right. Okay, so near the bottom, the bottom of the wall has some cracks, or maybe it's peeling. That doesn't sound like a fracture. Yeah, let's just look at the fracture hump, though. Calls cracks and fractures, and she's not really talking about fractures. Yeah, she's talking about some cracks, though. I don't know what else it could be, to be honest with you, though. It has to be something that's opening up, unless it's termites? Question mark. Would be termites. Nah, this makes no mention of cracks. I have no idea. Mentions it has some cracks, or maybe it's peeling. And here yeah, it says it's peeling not... page. Yeah. Uh, this is a tough one. I think it might be termites more than fractures. Yeah. Okay, you guys want termites? Mm -hmm. Let me just look at the fracture one again. Unless it's a gopher lamau? It could actually be. Yeah. Okay, let's see. See, what gets me is that it's at the bottom of the wall. Do termites typically do that mm. at the bottom? 
I've always feel like I've seen them up, up higher or in the wall, like higher up on the wall. I'm gonna get this somewhere, so it's gotta be from the bottom. All right. Yeah, could be. Okay, termites or fracture then? Termites. They were, they were termites. All right, I'm going termites. We'll just both be wrong. <laughs> this poor lady, if we fuck up, she's probably gonna lose her cat, just so you know. That's fine. Whiskers? I knew thee well, Whiskers. I hardly knew you. Uh. Rats. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Bees. Not the bees. Last week, I called you guys about some weird noises I had coming from my living room, and the info package you sent me said something about leaving out a bowl of cream? What kind of joke is that? It's been a week now that I've been dealing with this racket, no thanks to you, and now we're starting to have power outages. Your employee's stupid joke is now probably going to cost me who knows how much in repair costs. So talk to your manager and tell them they owe me big time. Mm. You figure out what's going on in my house, and you figure it out now! Okay, so from what I remember, that's the recommended way to deal with a hob, is to leave out a bowl right. of cream. Uh, just the hob again? Are things unrelated? So, power outages, right? Please hold. I don't think there's anything in the thing that says anything about power outages. Uh, yeah. Yeah, nothing. Uh, okay, let's, look, let's take a look at some of these other hobs. There's a pipe hob, right? Mm. He's complaining about uh, electricity going up. Yeah. Okay, um, so the common hob, right, is the one with cream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So. Okay, so here's the difficult thing. It, it's it's got to be a hob, but. Is it a hob? Do we send the hob again or do we, has it progressed to a boggart and he just doesn't know? Here, right here. It's a boggart. It's going to have to be a boggart. Mm. Because since he didn't oh, do that, yeah. yeah, since he didn't do that, since he didn't put the bowl of cream out, he's got a bogger. Mm -hmm. He's not complaining about anything else. Yeah, this the, the only thing I have to go on, though, is the electric outage and the fact that he didn't do what was recommended for a common hob. I don't know. Yeah, I think you're right. Okay. Uh, I'm going to go with bogger. Uh, unless... I don't know. Because Metamorphosis reads like you have to actively antagonize them. And he wasn't antagonizing them, he just didn't do the cream thing. Yeah, but I think if you don't do the cream thing, I think 100% you're guaranteed to get one of these things. Take measures to prevent Metamorphosis. I don't know. I guess try the boggart. Sam? Yeah, I agree. I can't tell where the boggart begins and ends. I think he's standing straight up. I don't know if he's leaning around something. It's hard to tell. Yeah. <clears throat> Come on, coupon. Science Ooh. mysteries. Hey, we got a coupon. Yeah, a silver medallion. Nice. Knocked off. Mm. Math. Uh oh, it's whiskers. So I guess the woman's dead. Yeah. <laughs> or it could just be another cat named Whiskers. It's a pretty common name for Whis. Why does it look yeah. like there's a cat spirit or something behind it? What the fuck? 
Well, I guess these super intelligent mice are uh, going to die. Yeah. To Whiskers is uh, Whiskers is, is, is here to stay. I guess hopefully mm -hmm. sooner or something. We get the one who is offering you uh, suffrage in his little hole. <laughs> oh yeah, we didn't get one from them. That sucks. I was kind of hoping to hear from him. Science. The mystery of mice. Thank you. Exhilarating. I hope to learn more. Mice. One of humanity's oldest friends and oldest enemies. Ain't no friend of mine, dude. Black plague to the shelves of our pet stores. Mice have lived alongside humans for centuries. And just like humans, mice may even be evolving alongside us as well. What? This is a mus musculus, otherwise known as the common house mouse. Mm -hmm. And this is mus musculus loquentis. What? Otherwise known as the smart mouse. The smart mouse? The smart mouse. species known for its uniquely colored iris. Okay. More importantly, it's increased intelligence. Uh... Mice yeah, I think that must be the one who was messaging you then. And yet... I think you're right. Science has observed they are capable of thinking quite intelligently. And in the case of the smart mouse, perhaps even capable of communication. With the help of modern computer technology, today's scientists have been able to interpret what if I am a mouse? indecipherable squeak of a, a mouse. smart mouse and have discovered what seems to be hidden messages within. Let's take a listen. It's definitely a mouse. Mm hmm. Thank you, Smart Mouse. What do you think? Is this a wonder of evolution? <laughs> or are we just hearing things that aren't there? <laughs> we just hearing mice things. I'm going crazy, <laughs> dude. <laughs> the mice is begging for help. I suppose that's what makes this a science mystery. A science mystery. Thank you. Da, 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 da. I appreciate it, my dude. All right. So, no email from the Smart Mouse that lives in the wall. Got it. Smart Mouse is dead. Rip Smart Mouse. Rest in peace, Smart Mouse. I knew you well. I would have totally hung out with you in your hole. Thank you very much. I hope you're well. I wish you the best. Double clock in. Do, 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 do. How many do you think these are? Hello, Carol. I don't know. Hello, Supervisor Carol here again. I've been watching the closely employee. The what? I'm impressed the. so far by your dedication mm -hmm. to accuracy. Oh, well, she's a fairy, isn't she? Yeah. So you should have access to more extensive household hazard information. We knew there was something wrong with her, so. Our eyes rest upon me. What the? F yeah. Can you, stop, can you stop saying the? No way she's not a fairy. My dude. The old English BS. A travel gnome. Highly invasive species. <laughs> species of gnome? Yeah. You got gnomes now? Oh, Jesus, dude. It's come. Over. Give me a second here. I'm trying to read. I think the map is something wrong with our faucet. Recently, I've been having the worst kind of stomach bug. Just aches and pains constantly. But after a month, still hasn't gone away, and I'm thinking there's got to be something wrong with the water, because we only eat fresh, homegrown fruits and vegetables here, and we never had any yeah. problems yeah. until then. Yeah, you're right. That's the beat. I keep hearing it's things about rusted pipes and water poisoning and all kinds of terrible things. Yeah, it's going to be the, the false beat or whatever. Let me just... Laundry gnome? What do you mean the horde? Look, we'll get back to it. Mm -hmm. That We'll get back to that. Let's see. False beat. I've never seen anything by disguising themselves from other vessels. Like root in the human stomach. Ooh. Yeah. I guess it's With playing off that. that urban myth of uh, swallowing a seed. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. Uh, okay. 
fresh homegrown homegrown fruits and vegetables okay and yeah it's, 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 and so yeah yes i don't know what other one i'm not willing to click onto these other ones i will take a look at this face though just to be oh god mm. he's definitely been fucking around with the face. <laughs> it's fatal but keeping no but keeping a clean fay free home my dude just keep your just just keep it nice and clean uh okay the rest of these are whatever a portal come on a six the seedling actually never remove a weed from a seedling infested garden yeah that's not gonna that's not our boy uh yeah. okay that'll be the fake beat yeah false beat <clears throat> unless anything else jumps out of you guys that's the only one that makes sense to me uh, wait i forgot to check this fey feast actually hold on oh great Is that flower yeah it was a fake piece, just endless amounts of cocaine. They just, I like how this, like, the danger is that they don't do anything, but they can attract cockroaches or carpenter ants. Mm -hmm. Funny. Uh, okay. So, fall speed. Come I don't speed. like that solution. <laughs> yeah. He's, uh, him and his family is donezo, my dude. Uh -huh. huh. The police told me to call this number, okay. so I uh, hope I got the right number here. Anyway, uh, I think I think somebody is stalking me. I can see their shadow at night at my window, just staring into the house. When I close the window, I can still hear him out there breathing. Okay, so somebody's watching grandma through the window. Just so he won't see me. The police said they can't do anything, so please send somebody or please hold. Okay. Uh, check this night gnome. This has got to be the night gnome. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's because, like, look, she talks about the she can hear him breathing, and it looks at him in the night and through her window. Yeah, it's gonna be this. What's the night wisp? Let's take a look. Bright floating lights. Shouldn't say anything about nights or it, lights. Yeah, and also doesn't talk anything about breathing. <laughs> you got a portal outside, ma'am. <laughs> ma'am, you have a whole ass portal. Come into locations. The cold drops and strange dreams and a strong desire to enter all right um night gnome is the one that makes the most sense to me everything else here is kind of like whatever yeah it's the only thing i think of is boggarts like to watch people while they sleep yeah but yeah, it, that's from inside like but outside exactly All right, we're going <laughs> place to sell the home immediately. Immediately. The introduction of a hob to the household can often assist in the process. That's nice. Hobs are pretty cool. When they're until they, you know, don't metamorphose. Yeah. Okay. Uh, night gnome then. Mm -hmm. Oh, night gnome. Can you imagine oh, can you imagine your whole subspecies of gnome and it's just like yeah i stand outside of windows and i look at people and i just breathe heavily i'm like <laughs> hello yes i believe there may be some kind of problem with our home ventilation lately we've been hearing awful mm. banging noises mm. coming from the ceiling and the air quality I'll seems to have been drastically yep. reduced my daughter hasn't been able to please hold. All right, uh, this is gonna be one of those uh, growths. Big attic one. Yeah. Uh, solar grotto. 
What the? Oh, a whole ass cave? What? It just appears? Alright. Let's see. Attic gnome. Hear a knocking. Knocking and rasping sound. So, that's a banging noise. From the ceiling, though, not from the attic. I know that that seems like a split hair, but. I say that's a split hair. Yeah. It could be an attic gnome, but let's look at one of these uh, gross. No. No, it's, it's not. Yeah, okay. So then cockroaches, common hob, desk hob. It's the horde. <laughs> it's in your attic. It's the whole ass horde, my dude. You fucked up. Laundry gnome. That's so funny. Okay, uh. Pipe gun. Yeah, no, nope, nothing there about sea air quality. Yeah, it's gotta be the, the attic. Okay, attic me, voice. Yep, I'm liable to agree with you at this point. Okay, attic gnome it is. It's the only thing that makes sense. Because it's air quality. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, attic gnome, done. Air quality related wow. issues due to a gnome infestation, huh? Mm -hmm. I can't imagine. I cannot imagine. Not an egg your charge you're holding them. Yeah, that's something. <laughs> it looks like she's holding a goat or like a lamb. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, chill out, lady. Come on. Uh, okay, so false artifact that creates a buzzing sound. The buzzing sounds sound like bees. Yeah. And while not a direct threat to adult humans, they can pose significant risk to small human children and animals. Bad yeah, time. So it's got to be the false sound effect. Mm hmm. So, oh, that's, that's a nice little thing at the I end. I see that. I see that. <laughs> <laughs> Lady. Sorry, ma'am. Lady. Uh, you're going to kick over that little, little tidbit. Yeah, it's going to definitely be the false sound effect. I knew it right away because of the buzzing and also because some of these just affect children and that's it. Yeah, a lot of these only affect children. Oof. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no. Little Timmy has just gone fucking missing because he's inside the TV and cannot be heard screaming. Yeah, does it say that it shows up as... Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay, false sound effect it is. It was probably posing as something like a TV. Uh, I think it may have been the bed, um, but yeah. You can see the kid's hands in the photo. Uh, yeah, I see that, actually. Hmm. That sucks. <laughs> Very thought I hope they send a free... I hope they send a free memory whisk for this lady, dude. <laughs> <laughs> they send a free replacement child. Yeah. <laughs> What I miss. You missed uh, a lady calling about uh, her. She lost her kid in the last. He's very concerned with bees and false artifacts make buzzing noises and uh, apparently consume kids and then just digest them for years. Oh, Hi. Jesus. Yeah. I'm concerned somewhat about the stability of my new home. This is going to be a fracture. Finalized the purchase yeah, cheese. It's fracture. found that there are several large cracks in the walls of the basement. It's the cheese and the uh, large cracks. As well as several pieces of. Please hold. Dude, I had your number right here. Watch this. Solution: cheese. Boom. <laughs> Keep firm those sing crop singles down the floor. Done, dude. Easiest one of my life, right here, dude. Don't even try to dissuade me. Fracture hob, hundred percent. Easiest. Well, right about the cat one, because she hasn't called back yet. 
So yeah. It must have been 10 minutes. Yeah, it must have been. It has to have been something that's not threatening to her. Also, why did she give us our cat, her cat? <laughs> she didn't want it anymore. I guess. And she's like, oh, this cat doesn't do anything with termites. Oh, I don't want her anymore. Cub rubber. <laughs> Orange drink. My favorite. I got a Cheesy greaser. So delicious. <laughs> Go away, dude. <laughs> Please stop calling. Stop calling me with your weird old thing. You got problems and it ain't and ain't. Uh huh. Oh. Huh? Satan. Yes, uh. Hey, so my doctor told me I should call this number. I have no idea why. He won't tell me anything. Oh, uh, he's got the faith flu, my dude. Yeah. So here goes nothing, I guess. Um. He's got the fave flu. It's not your typical flu. That's why you can't look it up on the internet. Please hold. All right. Yeah, you're done, my guy. You're done, though, dude. You ain't got shit. Ain't no. Ha Damn it. Yeah, it's, it's obviously fave flu. Yeah, we're going with we're going with, we're going with fave flu. Can I get the internet back now? Oh, no. uh, Robert, can you fix the internet for me? Brother, can I have some internet? Oh no, we're still in net network carrying, dude. Hmm. All right. <laughs> How hard can it be? Some of these are pretty self-explanatory. Why is your eye so big? big wooden splinters. There's no telling how much damage there is. I've got this big gaping hmm. one in my kitchen that I have no idea how Okay, so something goes. calling holes to top it all off, and a eats animals. To be found. She probably took off after seeing Please hold. Oh, we have the internet back. Nice. Okay. Uh No, I don't think it's a raccoon. <laughs> Although technically raccoon. that does fit all the descriptors. So you get that one. Okay, it's What's just... the unicorn fun guy again? Oh, it just puts a unicorn on them. Oh, wait, maybe you're right. Hold on. Oh, no, wait. A dog. Digging, but... Yeah. I don't think that caused holes in the walls. Well, might do. Hang on. No, 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 no. Well, actually. They can often lead to household problems such as broken floorboards. Yeah, I don't think he says anything about walls, actually. No, you're right. All over my house. Yeah. Stepping around. Big wood. Yeah. No, it's the, it probably is unicorn fun. Let me just check the wood secretions one, because I think... Nah, it's pink. Oh, wait. Wait, before we do that, let's go back to the bay flu. I want to read up on that one a little bit more. Because obviously it's like the pink stuff, right? <laughs> Yeah. Uh, yeah, I still would have picked that one. Yeah. Yeah. It's, everything it's is kind of pink. Tough. Yeah. Okay. So I think he's right. I think it's the unicorn fungi because the, the thing is missing and there's a bunch of holes. At least it goes away after a few months. It's nice. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and he described, well, I guess you could use that for walls, too. Okay, so we're in agreement then, Unicorn Funke? Yeah. And also, he's got a dog, so... Yeah. I didn't remember it, because I remember the picture of the Funke um, having a dog. Mm-hmm. Couldn't have really been anything else, I don't think. 
just big old mice, Lamel. Super ants. All right, I'm gonna need someone to explain what in the name of Christmas is happening to my living room. I'm back from vacation, and the mm. house is already turning into a disaster. Not 24 hours later, and this my living room is mom, absolutely could be. covered in soil. Um, plants. Looks like a gosh darn nursery. Please okay, hold. Let's look. More of this damn no inter interventions, dude. Ooh. Let's see. Yep. <laughs> yep. That's yep. It. Oh, what a pain in the ass. <laughs> it's a huge pain in the ass, dude. Uh. Yeah, okay. Um, what's a little confusing here is that they stole away in luggage and then, okay, yeah. I like the solution. It's just just invite people over and hope that they, hope that they go for them instead. That is the dick way to get rid of your problems, dude. It's like give it to somebody else, an unsuspecting person. No thanks, dude. I'd probably kill whoever did that, gave me a travel gnome. <laughs> Ironically, would I would find them, would dude? Not find the corpse because it would be in the fucking forest. <laughs> because it would be in a forest of uh, you know, travel gnome creation, travel gnome jungle creations. There's something. There's something in my basement. I don't know what it is. All I know is uh, when I open basement, my basement smells, door, it smells like it and makes noises. Door, and I can hear it making all kinds of Horrible noises. Please okay. hold. Basement smells like a sewer and it makes all sorts of noises. So, uh, does the stair slug say anything about smell? No. Ooh. Nope. Okay. Uh, is it a portal? Uh, let's talk. I was either that or the grotto. It might be the grotto. Oh, yeah, it's stuck up in the breezes. So. Mm hmm. Um, Start from the top here. Good teeth, bees, black mold, boggart. Let me check the boggart real quick. Yeah, nothing about smell there. Okay, cellar so grotto. Yeah, it's gotta be the grotto. <laughs> oh, he's gonna have a fun time roofing this one. Yeah. Uh, present them with a gift of gold, huh? Mm -hmm. Great. You gotta be so monkey. Oh man, this was a little hard because this, he's talking about noises and he's talking about um, smells. It's gotta be a grotto though, because that's gonna smell like rank ass. Oh yeah, okay. Well, after report a bad smell coming from the basement. Yeah, that's it. It's gonna be a cellar grotto. Dude, I hope you like spelunking, my dude. <laughs> uh. Horrible noises. Okay. We're going with Cellar Grotto. It's okay cool. they could use our grotto removal team. Yeah, which gives... <laughs> yeah, the... H H S H is a lot of subsidiaries. Not, Not Cellar, cellar Grotto. Yeah, cellar. yeah, yeah. I saw it. Cellar Grotto. You see how it would get them confused? They're very, yeah. they're very close to each other. Uh... Bring spelunking and snorkeling equipment on your excursion, or consider having someone else do it. <laughs> cool. I don't know why this guy didn't just poke his head down and see that giant ass grotto in his basement. Uh, not gonna lie, dude. If I opened up my basement, looked down there, and I just saw like a whole ass grotto, I'd be pissed. I'd be mad. Like, I'd be calling and threatening people. Cool. Don't come to the hole. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> so it's Whiskers! No. Whiskers, no! You're gonna kill him! Oh no, dude! Mike's done for. Mike! Mike, run! Mike, get out of there! Don't send me an email, just get out of there, dude! Oh man, Saturday and Sunday? Damn. Oh wow. This really is a cool Sunday. This place sucks. Hey, we got a, we got a coupon. Team River Root. What? The undersoil? The soil, the soil, the soil. Why was they come? For you. 
root in for you dude i'm not buying roots from some weird call center of my dude i'm not doing that uh okay rest in peace mike dude oh man <laughs> we, got, we got a lift for mike dude i feel i do it come on my boy mike needs to get out of this dude i'm gonna be pissed if he doesn't survive I'm like, when he's attacked, he's trying to help you. Dude, seriously, like, I, I feel for him because all caps, picture that he sent me with of a cat looming through his hole. No, nah, dude. Like, that, that, that man was looking out for me, dude. I got to do the same for him. If I can. All right, Carol. What's next? What other access do I have? Okay. Are we sure we're in the stuff? Because it's like no one calling. Yeah. Nope. Oh, there we go. Carol. There we go. Hey, Carol. Hello. Thine accuracy. Hello, Carol here. Thine above accuracy and below the scene. Oh, she is a fairy. Just like everyone in HR. My eyes rest soundly upon the. Yeah, thanks for letting me know. Animation? What? Oh, hell no, dude. Nice. Dude, chill. Oh, it's one of those. It's that bush. It's that bush. Um, hold on. Where is it? Oh, it's the false rose bush. Here we go. I don't think it is. Because it doesn't have anything to do with black liquids or yeah. torn fabric. Okay, yeah, you're right. Okay, so let's take a look. Closet labyrinth. Could be, one of the new ones. Could be one of the new ones, actually. Let's try the dream weaver. Oh, spider. Oh, nice. Awesome. Look at that. Parasitic in nature. Okay, uh, false flower. Mm, nope. Ignore their singing. That is so funny. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. So what do we have? Cobalt. Dang. I the green cobalt. Tree. Liquid disappeared. Um. Child, teenager. Oh hell no, dude. Never. <laughs> Do not ever enter a cobalt domain. That's funny. Oh, here we go. Retreat. Ooh. Ooh. I take root in a human's body. Nice. Canonical <laughs> structure damage to a home. They're incredibly deadly to those who are affected. And result in the death once they reach a certain size. Or the black substance that leaks from them. Yep. Would you uh, see that? Yeah, our sun didn't disappear and turn into a tree. Mm. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Rip. That's metal. Do not touch infected yep. on okay. the black stuff. Yep. Let me just check the spray Yeah, lines. and the tree's covered in black uh, torn up fabric. Yeah. yeah. So the kids exploded. <laughs> the spriggan has been provoked. That is so funny. Uh, okay. Sprig tree. Lady, oh, that, that vine must have been what the uh, house is covered in in the video. Oh yeah, that wonder it was fucking cheap. Yeah, it's their pissed off a smirking. No wonder it was cheap. Uh, uh someone get this woman a memory sprite, dude. Honestly, this lady saw like her. She's calling to me complaining about satanic cults and Dungeons and Dragons, and she just casually drops that her kids have been gone for days, dude. <laughs> you lead with that <laughs> you lead with i haven't seen my children in days and then go into your crazy conspiracy theories yeah what do you think hey i called last week about some noises in my house and after following the instructions you sent me they still seem to be happening i already told you guys what was happening but uh the short story is that every night i'm hearing clattering noises coming oh, from the one kitchen. of those hobs in the morning i usually check the kitchen for any signs of droppings or whatever 
but the place looks spotless. Can you please please hold? It's gonna be one of those hobs because it's, it's just cleaning stuff. It's gotta be Hobbiton then, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I think it's a, a, a red herring to be something else because it's the exact same thing. Could be. Let's take a look at our options here. There has to be something that's cleaning. Yeah, if you, if you follow the instructions for the hob, you're still going to make the noises. It's just not going to yeah. turn them off. Yeah. Uh, just keep doing it, bro. Forever. <laughs> yeah, it's a labyrinth, dude. Just go in there. Yeah. yeah. Just get lost in there, my dude. Okay, I don't think it's 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 a toss-up. They're specifically talking about the kitchen. Yeah, he's specifically talking about the kitchen and how the kitchen is clean, so it could be oh, trash now? Oh, he literally just leaves in the trash. Great Roman trash. Soaps. Hmm. Nope. Rain nymph? Nope. Okay. Um, uh, pipe pop? Hmm. Doesn't seem like it. Yeah, it would have to be from directly from the pipe, right? So. Nightwish? Oh wait, this one's the one that mm, like whispers to you, Lama. Uh, yeah. Laundry Dome? Nope. All right, I'm liable to believe yeah, that it's just I, a common hob. It's just a common hob. It's it's gotta be that. Just check a couple more of these here. So I think this is just an idiot who didn't read the instructions. Yeah. Common hob, cockroaches, closet, salad, gross cellar, carbon monoxide, bogger, talking with bees, bed teeth, bed bugs, bat, attic, gnome, animation. Okay, I'm gonna go with common hob. Right. You know, um, you know, those hobs last forever, bro. They're not, they're not a one and done thing. And they come in Ooh. different var varieties. It's a whole fucking smash, bro. Those rosters of hobs. Mm hmm. Power Rangers of hobs. Oh, Becky, you probably... uh, the singing is going to be that one thing we were looking at. Yeah. The singing is going to be this... Um... What was it? No, it's the false flower or whatever. Yeah. It sings. The only thing that doesn't that that doesn't yeah be, it's it's got to be this one because it, it sings yeah but it's complaining about breaking the greenhouse yeah I'm singing but there's no one breaking in it's it's just the flower singing yeah but also mm, what's concerning me is that she mentions that it's happening at night. Ooh, but the flowers are the same time. Right. So, yeah, what you got? Doesn't seem to care about day or night. Yeah. 
I said, I think it's just bad not noticing it until it's, you know, night and quiet. Mm hmm Okay, let's see. Okay, um... It's the only thing I can think of, unless oh, we missed one when we were reading. I don't know what it would be. What about a Night Wisp? No. no nothing. Noise. Nothing. There's nothing about singing there, so. And then. Uh, let's see this rain now. Yeah. Uh, see them? Mm, no. It's a god in the greenhouse. Okay. So. What about with hold on. No. No. Huh. Interesting. I'm going to go with Okay, so it's a greenhouse, right? Mm -hmm. So it can't be the whistling fungi because the whistling fungi um, Greenhouses yeah. don't have drywall gaps and cracks No, they typically it's just glass. glass So the only thing I can think of is it's gonna be that one Let me just go through this real quick again Yeah, I don't see what else it could be to be honest with you. It's gotta be this yeah. Yeah, I agree. Okay. Sam? Probably anything else. Sam, you good with that? Sam has been taken by a bug. Here we go. Also. <laughs> that it being a night thing could have just been misdirection. Yeah. I think it's a small she couldn't hear it. Yeah. Until night, because night's definitely a little more quiet than the yeah. day. That makes sense too. So this is a very loud computer fan. Yeah. <clears throat> hello. Hey, oh, hello. Here. I've got two dumbbells that I bought from you that need a good spit shine. Know what I mean? I mean, these bells have got all kinds of grit, grime, grease. Can't even see my face in them when I'm deadlifting. No is this I mean. Mike? I mean, I'm looking at these Mike? bells is this right me? now here. I'm seeing uh, spit, crud, and juice. And, uh... Hey, who, who are you? How did you get in? Hey, now, now easy there. Get away. Get away. Is that someone drilling into a wall? Uh, I think that was Mike. <laughs> Hi, Mike. I think Mike has been calling us. <laughs> <laughs> He's been prank calling us. Yeah, I uh, I think he has been calling us, my dude. Oh, I don't think he's going to be calling us anymore. Rest in peace, Mike, I guess. With whatever happened. Oh, Hello. Supervisor Hi, Carol. Carol here. I noticed that you've been experiencing regular disruptive calls from a false caller with ulterior motives. Oh. I've seen to it that this false no. caller shall Mike. Be a blight upon me. <laughs> Keep up the good work. You bastards. Mike. I like Thanks. Mike. Made the, made the work day worth it. Yeah, and I love how he was always just calling and it was always some dumb sh He was always just calling with some dumb shit complaint. Yeah. Yeah, Mike just got taken out all over the phone. Mike just got taken out? Yeah. He's gone. He's gone, dude. How? Well, uh, he he was behind... Oh, Jesus. He was behind the... Um, someone calling us? Yeah, the weirdo calling us. 
house, and I, I think it may have died. Uh, I what? saw this big, nasty thing fly in through the window, and I haven't been able to find it anywhere, but I, I think maybe it electrocuted itself somewhere because I can... Please. Oh, okay, a flying one. Uh, that might be a limp one. Yeah, I think you're right. Um, Where is it? Uh, lamp, right? Lamp spray. I knew it was gonna do that. I knew it was gonna give me a oh, network oh, oh. error. I was feeling it in my bones, dude. It has to be the lamp sprite, unless you guys remember anything else. I don't know. Can it be a lamp sprite? Because that's the only one I remember being fire related. That's not, you know, a house fire. Yeah. We're going with lamp sprite. <laughs> <laughs> you got a house fire, dude. Mm -hmm. I, you know what? I was almost thinking that it, the way he was describing it, that everything was burning. I was like, dude, dude your house is on fire. You need to go, dude. <laughs> no, I like that advice will also work for a lamp sprite. Just get out of there. Yeah, you you got to go, dude. You got to, like, find something to do, my dude. You can't be, like... You can't be sitting there in a whole-ass fire. Mm-hmm. So yeah, Mike's super dead. Yeah, Mike's hella dead, dude. Damn. He got taken out, and then Carol, Carol called me afterwards to tell me that he got taken out. That's how dead he is. It, it took my daughter. It took my daughter. She, she's gone. It wrapped its awful tendrils around her and took her down with it. I saw it with my own eyes. Please. This is this is that floor route, yeah. Yeah, I don't think you can do much now, fam. Yeah. She's gone. <laughs> yeah, she's fucking dumb. Yeah. Although it's kind of concerning that it happened so it happened so quickly. Hmm. Don't know what else it could be. We got a lot of options now. Shit, dude. Mm. So I don't remember being a lot of these being actively malicious. Well, the thing is, it's, it grabs small things, right? Mm. Well, it doesn't specify that it... You know, human children and pets are, are the ones that are most affected by it. It dragged him yeah. down. It has tendrils. It could be something else. Yeah. It could be something else. Let's see. No. Uh, what about one of these false? No. 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 Nah. I mentioned tendrils. Mm -mm. Being a child in this universe sucks. Yeah, I'm feeling that. Frozen pipes go for the horde. House fires, house fly, house spider. Cobalt. Let's check the cobalt one again. Yeah, it's not up. Yeah, not tendrils. Laundry gnome, lamp spray. Oh, let's read the lamp spray one again, actually. Yeah, okay. We were right. It was a lamp sprite. It causes a burning spell in the home. Okay, uh... No... No... Pipe growth? No tendrils on this one. Nah. Okay, uh... Portal, rain name, seedling... Oh, hold on. Seedling? No. Nah. The insects. Vines? Let's see. Nah, this only affects really the house. Stir slugs, tea sprites, termites, ticks, toilet hob, trash stone, travel gnome, unicorn fungi. Nah, it's gonna have to be the uh, floor roots. Alas. Mm, uh, that's just secretions. Yeah. Okay. Floor roots it is. Get this man a memory wisp. <laughs> Everybody gets a memory yeah. wisp, my dude. Everybody needs a memory wisp at this point. It, 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 it stole me. Mm. It stole me. It's a mirror nymph. I'm, I'm mm -hmm. not. Please hold. The mirror nymph. Fuck. Turn it up. 
Hmm, actually... Yeah, they can't see me. I mean, I can't see myself anymore. Seems to be that. I'm gonna say it's that. I can't think of what else it could be. Yeah, I think it's just a mirror boy. I'm not able to just say mirror boy. Everything else just kind of doesn't make sense. Unless. Let's stop with them. No. Okay. It's going to be mirror, gro uh, mirror fairy nymph. Oh, mirror growth. Mirror growth. It could be, dude. We, we could be missing a mirror growth entry. Mirror nymph. Got it. I think with the abundance of all these cryptids or whatever, I'm pretty sure that there's no duplicate answers. Okay. I think some homeless or druggies might be in my house mm. because I keep finding used needles, cans, metal scrap, and other such oh, nasty no. things on my living room carpet. That sounds like cold. I have children in this house, and this is a very oh. serious hazard to their health. Yeah. And before you say anything, yes, I already called the police. How old? Yeah, that's gonna be the horde. It's a horde. Take a look. Yep, used syringes, rotten food. Yep, that's the horde, all right. <laughs> You're done, my dude. You gotta sell your house. You gotta get out of there, bro. What's the call to me? I don't know, dude. It's 1996 or whatever. They're selling houses for 20k. No strings attached. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> Yeah, I like how the uh, Sprinkin just curses the house until he gets bored. Mm-hmm. He gets bored, and then he goes home, and then he's like, eh, maybe I'll find someone else to mess with. Yeah, is there some kind of home security camera I can purchase from you guys? For the last few nights, we haven't gotten any sleep mm. thanks to some punks mm -hmm. outside with flashlights or something. Someone keeps flashing these bright lights through our windows at night, but I haven't been. Please hold. Um. Okay. Flashing lights. It's the, the wisp, isn't it? Uh. Yeah. But this one's the wisp. The night wisp predominantly whispers and talks. But let's see. Yeah. Uh, it could be. Yeah. Form of bright floating lights. He doesn't mention anything about them talking, though. Well, I don't know anything I'm drawing out the whispers with music, so... Yeah. It's gotta be this one. Because mm. it talks about whispers in the solution. Yeah, but he didn't say anything about whispers. He just said something about lights. What's the other one? That had lights? Um... Great question. Let's see. Let's see. Color goes closet, labyrinths, cockroaches, common hump, desk hub, dream weaver. Mm -hmm. Yep. Big feast, false dire fact, false beat, false rosebush, false roots, fracture, hob. Frozen pipes go for the horde, house fires. It's house fire, my dude. House fires. <laughs> You could actually be a housewife. <laughs> <laughs> no. No. Nice small night gnome, night wisp, portal raccoon, yeah, random nice. seedlings, soap sprite, spring tree, spring vines, tea sprite, termite sticks, toilet hob trench. Yeah, it's the only one that makes sense. Oh, wine sprite. Good. Funny. Okay. Uh, Night Wisp. Wait, I just want to see the Night Gnome again, real quick. Here it is.
Yeah, nothing about light. All right. Yeah. If anyone has light, yeah. whisper this. Unless you count me up a portal. Uh, portal doesn't have any night lights attached to it. I think all it does is it just tells you, know, tries to get you to enter it, which is like the funniest shit. Hey, um, hey, man, you want to go on an adventure? Why don't you come into this magical portal? Come on. Come on. There you go. Hey, uh, so... It's a portal. I think I found... Please hold. It's a portal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just, just go through it, fam. That's fine. It's a portal, my dude. <laughs> it's the only thing it could be. Strong desire to enter... Yeah. Cause drafts. All right. Portal it is. I like how one of the, the side effects is that it could cause heating issues in your house. That's so funny. I mean, that is a legit problem. Yeah. In this economy, dude? Yeah. Forget about drafts in the window. How about drafts from another dimension? <laughs> about needing to draft to your money because you have none because it costs a fortune to have heating in this to, in this uh world Ooh. their universe my other. this might like sound strange but i think there's some kind of like squid that would be with that soap sprite like i went into the bathroom in the middle of the yep. night last night you know little soap thing see something slithering mm -hmm. under yeah, she, with his, like, she, uh, like, said so. mm -hmm. or, like, tendrils, or, you know, whatever. But when I turned on the lights, nothing was there. <laughs> I checked under the towel, like, please. Yeah, oh, it's definitely a soft spray. Uh, any objections? Nope. Uh oh. Unless she says so, so. Yeah. Gotta be a soap break. She directly calls attention to the soap, so. There we go. Problem solved. Nice. Finally. Alright, now let's hear from my boy Mike, who is definitely not in any perils. Save me, Mike. He's definitely not having any issues because he surely... Oh my god. Okay, let's see. Oh. Mm, Mike. Mike. No. Hey, we did a, we did good. We got a hag hide. Oh my god. <laughs> Haggling for deals. Best quality sleep you'll ever get. That's so funny. Keep your... Sleep easy. Sleep safe. It comes with an iron wall mount. That's so funny. Okay. Thunder Peak. Talk to me more about, you know, strange mice. This is a. Uh, Best prepared. This is beautiful trails. Knock off into the mystic by Van Morrison. <laughs> I can tell because it's like one of my favorite songs ever. So. That's a prize you'll need. As with any hiking trail, I want to ensure you come prepared with supplies to help you the physical, demanding trail ahead. Sure to bring the hiking boots. essential. Sam, comment on this. 
don't break your feet. Hiking boots and water bottle, would you consider those essential? Yep. Okay. Okay, an iron sword. <laughs> would you consider Absolutely. Would you consider that essential? Uh, yep. Okay. Climbing gloves. Climbing gloves? Not essential. Oh. Uh, access to the material to make sure to contact one of the Thunder Peak Park guides before embarking. Yeah, hi. Me too. What's more, straight from the blacksmith. Yeah, hi. I forgot my Our... iron sword at home. Can I get one? Yeah, Can I... if our universe will fade, then I will oh, not yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Iron sword. Iron. iron. I did a lot of research into this, but iron was uh, considered to be like a, a repellent or a curative for the phase, so. That's where D&D gets the idea of cold iron from. Mm hmm. I don't like these caves, my dude. Oh, that's cool. You show some see progress. This can sound like an analogy. It helps you appreciate the scenery around you. It's a nice choice. Yeah, it looks, it looks very, very scenic. What's behind the rocks? High rock fall area, okay. <laughs> Completely silent. Uh. Okay. Uh huh. Uh. Oh. <laughs> uh. No. <laughs> I'm not taking my boots no. off, my dude. That's a safety hazard. Aside from whatever supernatural stuff is about to happen. What do you mean? Enter the cave. <laughs> it's like this fantasy what? door. Look at this door with a pretty modern lock on it, actually. Mm -hmm. yeah, that makes sense. Dude, I'm not going inside of a cave and then moving quietly and carefully, my dude. What the fuck? What do you mean, don't stop? No. No, go back and put your shoes on, first of all. Do not stray. Now, Kirk... Oh, yeah, that's, that's one thing I want to leave him to save me. Fucking fairy lights. Yeah, uh, real quick, elucidate me on this, but typically caves don't have multiple... Unsheath your sword. Ha <laughs> hmm. ha. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Typically what? Typically caves. <laughs> there you go. Spin back up. You did it. Typically caves don't have multiple X like ways around, right? It's typically one big tunnel. There's little cracks and stuff that you could get lost in if you were really adventurous, but they typically don't go that far, do they? Depends on the cave system. Yeah, okay. I just avoid them like the plague. Yeah, don't just catch me not being anywhere near any caves, especially caves that require to me me to be armed with an iron sword ahead of time What's the, worst that could happen? the worst that could happen is that they don't make iron like they used to make it and the fae just like yeah. laughs at my impotence that look like a pretty solid iron sword to be fair i mean i agree with you but this was also 1996 or whatever they don't just don't make them like that anymore That's true. mostly because we just don't we just don't use iron for that stuff anymore true I'll be here, Yep. What? Park. Park employee, lend thine ear once more. <laughs> Supervisor Carol here again. I've updated thy permissions to grant thee access to all relevant household hazard information. <laughs> Right. Continue thy labors, employee. Soon thy time in the soil arrives. Yay! Body. Thank you, Carol. I'd love to. Ugh. Carol. Great. Bed hag? Put the hag in my bed, if it's what I say. Some sort of gnome that's 
Trying to get drunk. Dorser is one who delivers. Homeborn is experiencing Dorser report feelings of immense dread, followed by the sensation of being followed or pursued. <laughs> Dorsha will deliver what it seeks. There is no going back from deliverance. Dorsha is otherwise harmless to humans it does not seek. Great. <laughs> Except to be sought by Dorsha is to be found by Dorsa. If you want your loved ones to show by Dorsa, it's fucking over. It's over. It's done. Grieve and find peace through acceptance. Thank you, Home Health Safety Hotline. Thank you. Okay, something here loves bottles and it's a fucking leprechaun. I can't even tell what that is. No, it's not a leprechaun. This I is see it's like this thing like loves to eat metal or whatever. <laughs> Neighbor's Neighbor. door. Oh. Hello? Door like structures. And step through <laughs> as well as parallel. Yeah, don't uh don't step through any doorways. Yeah. What the fuck? Oh yeah, these are the uh the pet things that kill your pets and replace them. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah yeah. <sighs> Reanimation. Okay. Nice. Oh yeah, it's it's just a zombie. It's literally just a zombie, huh? Alright, great. Spriggan. Spriggins, there he is. There's the boy. Where is he? I don't see him. He's gotta be in the window. Maybe this thing right here? Maybe. Yeah, it looks like a little weed thing. Yeah. In the window. Uh, barely see him. Uh, troll? Oh, there's the troll. Look at the troll. Look at the boy. Do not ever approach a troll. He don't gotta tell me twice, dude. Mm -hmm. Uh. Warlock's remains. Oh, yeah, as you know. It's just a typical warlock. There's whatever's left of the warlock. It's not, not a big deal. Uh. So it's gotta be the wine sprite. Yeah, I think you're right. I was gonna say bat, but it talks about the wine. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Flapping, so that's the sound of wings. Yeah. Yeah, okay. We're doing wine sprite. The only thing that makes sense because it's either a, a gnome because you know they're mischievous um, little bastards or the wine sprite fits perfectly because of the description of flapping damn these damn. these things are off the hook so uh i, I think something may have died inside my dad oh that's the uh, the wood secretion oh, yeah just just eat that stuff mm -hmm. it's delicious Rancid translation of flesh. Yep. Okay. Wood secretions it is. Mm -hmm. Do not insult or shout at wood. <laughs> yeah, I mean, um, it makes sense. In a, in a world where the fairies exist, where the fae are an issue, yeah, just kind of don't treat their homes badly. Look at them, but like I know they're out there. I've seen their eyes. I don't know who they are, but the police were Please hold. Spriggans, because they're the, the police seem to know yeah, what's I going on. Spriggans. I can't think of anything else. Only thing else I could think of was a tree. Sorry, a uh, troll. The physical contact will result in a sprig tree. So that's how you make sprig trees. So nice. That's how the kid died. They touched the sprig. So I mean, trees, flowers, or weeds do not ever kill or hunt wildlife with the mere heart. Do not eat any wild fruit or vegetables that may grow on your property. Okay. Uh, sprig. Do not ever kill or hunt. Uh, sprig it is. Did we get? We did get a, a coupon from the last run. Yeah. Yep. It was the hack hide. 
Right. I'm still kind of salty we missed one of them. Oof. But that's one of them. Yeah, it's fine. I mean, we couldn't have known. But we've only gotten one angry phone call. Yeah. It's honestly doing better than I thought we would. My brother told me to call this number, but I don't know why. Oh, uh, this is that Things friggin' vines. No, 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 no. He's just she's describing warmth. Like the way the leaves move. The way they yeah, grow the one. It, oh. it could be. I think it's the autumn vines. Yeah, it's autumn vines. That's what I was thinking of. Blissful. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's gonna be the uh, autumn wind. Mm -hmm. Cannot be anything else. Yeah. Uh, let me just compare it to the spray wind. Yeah, no. Okay, autumn leaves. Autumn cool. vines, sorry. Still gonna kick out that one. Hi. Do you know how I got here? I'm. I I'm not. It's the dimension I, be. I think it's the neighbor's thing. Please, I was yeah, told that you could help me. My family. Please, how old? Okay, let's see. Um. Or it could also be a puzzle. No, I think the parallelism that it's talking about is this one. Um. Yeah. She sounds confused. Yeah, I've stepped through. Such as altered behavior or perceived missing memories in the human that come to me on the other side. So yeah, she stepped through. <laughs> One can prevent neighbors' doorways from occurring by practicing mindfulness and not letting one's mind wander to wishing to also like that. That's funny. Yeah, um... So yeah, I think she stepped through the neighbor's door. Okay. We're doing neighbor's door. It's the I think that's the confusion. That's the biggest tell for me because she sounds really confused. Yeah. That'd be too if I was living an alternate life with myself. Yeah. And if you don't recognize your family, but they kind of look like your family, but you still don't recognize them. Mm -hmm. mm. Shit's fucked. Yeah. Hi. Yeah. There's this awful smell of rotten Oh, it's this is that face you see. Yeah. And when I looked to see what it was, I saw this awful, disgusting pile of crap on my dinner table. Uh, I got upset. Oh, face. Yeah. Uh, face. Let's see. Mm -hmm. What is it made out of? Flour, cornmeal, and various species of fungi. That is disgusting. Yeah. This is a sign of a hospital presence. It should be consumed immediately. Yeah, I'm not too sure about that. Yeah, I'm, I'm a little confused because it doesn't mention anything about food or uh, smell. It could just be one of those inference things. I think it might be the feast, but she's not noticed it till it's like started to rot. Yeah. Wait, she doesn't say anything about. Oh no, wait. Yeah, the awful smell of rotten eggs coming from my dining room. What else could it be if it's not this? It has to be this. I can't imagine anything else. Literally on a dinner table. Mm. Known, known to appear near yeah. eating areas of the... It's gotta be this. Yeah. I can't think of anything else it could be. Because all it, this is just like offerings. Yeah. Uh, Faith Feast. I mean, if it attracts cockroaches and carpenters, it's going to smell like shit. Yeah. Hey, yeah, Paul here. Um, I'm not 
not sure what to do anymore. Uh, my kids can't sleep at night. I've been spraying about 50 different kinds of pesticides all over the place, washed and scrubbed all the bed sheets as much as freaking possible. This is bed bugs. And every night it's the same story. No. Bunch of itchy kids with nightmares waking up at 4 a.m. and night making night. them sleep in Papa's bed. Oh, is it the, the Dreamweaver? Yeah, Dream Guy. It's a complaint about waking up at 4 o'clock with nightmares. And no other spiders are present. Is it this? Yeah. They, they feed, feed off dreams of human while they sleep. Mm. Well, this is not causing any harm to humans. It increased the anxiety. So then one is going to her father's room to see anxiety. Yeah, he. but he's mentioning itchy kids. Is it the webs that are causing the itchiness? They might. And large webs. webs. Yeah, it's the webs. Okay. Let's see if, it makes, if anything else makes sense too, but I think you're right. Let's just check the the bed bug ones. Did we already use bed bugs once? Probably not. I don't think we use bed bugs at all. But see, this is also. It mentions itchiness specifically. Ooh, I think that's a red hair. Uh, you could be right. Let's check the bed hang actually. Hold on. Actually, it could be a bed hang. From breathing problems. Nah, this is not relevant. Uh, itching. Nothing about itching. Bed teeth? I don't think it's bed teeth. Because it causes like cuts and stuff, right? Mm. Mm. It's like itching. Acidic. It could be bed bugs, but I don't know why they'd be waiting till like 4 a.m. to start crying and oh. stuff. Yeah, but look, bed teeth are not directly given their brief sleeping schedules. Tend to grow sharper, but they're not complaining about like cuts. Yeah, but they're complaining about itching. This one's hard. <sighs> not directly harmful to most humans, given the recently discussions. Okay, um, I'm gonna go with the original one. I think Dreamweaver might be. It's the itchiness that's doing me in, though. Like nowhere here does it mention anything about itchiness. Could be caused by the webs. Could be. But really should refrain from sleeping for as long as possible. This is the worst one ever. Mm -hmm. Whew, man, this was rough. Mm -hmm. The fact that he's spraying pesticides makes me think that it is a Dreamweaver because it's just like a spider thing. Yeah, I think it's a dreamy, dreamy boy. Dreamweaver. The fact that they're having like nightmares and stuff is what tips me off. Mm -hmm. The other ones don't really mention anything about that. <clears throat> Alright, so the kids are dead. Yeah, they're done. It was a dream hag actually, lol lol lol. Lamo. Breathing teeth. We're still freezing our butts off over here. That's the leprechaun. So tell me what the hell is happening. Please hold. Freezing. The leprechaun's probably stealing stuff from the heater. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right here. Medical implants such as braces and crowns. Oh, damn. Yep. I feel sorry for that kid. Yeah, no wonder. Yeah, that's pretty conclusively that. Mm -hmm. The kids probably has like um, yeah, braces or something. Braces removed. Yeah. Ooh, that's very painful. Yeah. Uh, oh man, that one was pretty easy in comparison to the other one, dude. The other one was kicking my ass. Mm -hmm. And I still don't think we got it right. I guess we'll find out tomorrow. Yeah. Um, pranksters might be giving my 
my wife and I a run for our money. <sighs> Lately, my wife's clothes have started going missing, and at night I keep hearing this strange. Please hold. Oh. Mm -hmm. yeah. Troll? Yeah. Yep, it's a troll because it's stealing more materials. And it's shrill clothes. sounds of air escaping in the middle of the night. Yeah, let's let's hear that audio sample. Let's hear them thoughts go. Let's hear them. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a whoopee cushion. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I kind of the description of just losing clothing and stuff mm. was what tipped me off. This is that, uh, for a bit of afternoon Earl Grey when I heard this awful buzzing sound coming from the cupboard. I looked around inside, but I couldn't find anything. That's a tea, though. Yeah, tea spray. Yeah, I think it's a tea spray. You're right. <laughs> no help there. Mm -hmm. He keeps talking about tea, though, so that's that's the biggest. Yeah, it's gotta be tea. That's the biggest kind of tell we have. They kind of softball the ones we can't check. Yeah, makes sense. It makes sense. Which one of these haven't we gotten? Sprig vines, rain nymph, reanimation, seedling, puka. Quite a few haven't seen. The portal. Oh no, we got the portal. We got the portal. Uh, mole. No mole. We got. There wasn't a pipe growth. Uh, pipe growth. I don't think we got. No house spider or a bat or bed bugs. Animation. Uh. Mm -hmm. Uh, hag? Already, but he said to call here, yeah, that's so a hag. Been, uh, Wait, have haven't had any issues, and it's just the I adults that are affected? Please, how old is That's gotta be a... Oh, dude. Hag. Oh, it's no. Okay. It has to be a bed hag, right? It can't be anything else. Yeah. It, it talks about uh, asthma. So it's gotta be a bed hag. Okay. Bed. Hey. Ooh. Gotta be a bed hag, yeah. Well, we have no, yeah, we have no options now because we don't have fucking internet. Damn. Any day now for my network connection to be fixed, please and thank you. Come on. Ring. What the hell is that? Sounds like a humming of a singer. Can you hear that? It's been on stop lately. Please hold. What the hell makes music? Uh, what was the mushrooms? It's the whistling. Yeah, fungi. it's the whistling fun guy. Yep, that's it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Once they're singing in harmony, evacuate your home immediately. Yeah. Get the fuck out of there. Yeah. <laughs> Run. Let's just hear that one more time. Lady, get out of there. You have everything unlocked now? Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. We're in too deep now. Yeah. We're on Saturday, so. Hey, yeah, Paul here again. 
Thanks so much for nothing, pal. I okay, so we got one of them wrong. It is Jack. I ain't got no wink of sleep. My kids are breaking out in all sorts of rashes. See ya. What was his issue again? Uh, he was the one that we picked uh, Dreamweaver for. Oh, uh, I guess it was bed bugs. It could have been bed bugs, yeah. Fine. Whatever. Fine. Yeah. Delayed onset of rashes. That's uh Puka. Terrible That's terrible smell yeah, in my house, Puka. and I can't be. Please hold. Puka. <laughs> this boy. Hmm. Man, I wish you could miss more than one and you still get the coupon. Yeah. No coupon fees. It's not. <gasps> Mike! Huh? Mike, Mike is alive! Mike! <laughs> get out of there, Mike! Run. <laughs> Mike, run! No, Mike! Oh, damn it. Mike! <laughs> Mike, I'm coming for you, Mike. We'll draw the walls. We'll go in the hole. We'll go in the hole together, Mike. Delicious human DNA. Yeah. Intrigue browser. Oh, dude, so we got the yes, we still got the coupon, dude. Wham, Wham nice. Look at that. Wham glam. Thank you, ma'am. All right, let's see. Ascension and so we can pass the what, trial. What? The soil is fertile. <laughs> Keep up the great oh, work. No. All right. What is this? Oh, is well, this... I guess you can see where the entries for for free now. Nice. Is this the trial? Is this is the last thing gonna be like a, a final test? I guess. Alright. I hate the Fae. Yeah. I could do without them to be honest with you. What? Hmm. Oh. oh. Uh oh, great. Oh, my trial has begun. Awesome. Thanks. Are you going to be able to read anything? Probably not, but we'll see. Please. Oh. That'd be a bot, and those would be bees. Yeah, it's me. Thanks. Bee-related issues. Bee-related issues. Uh, it could be an animation. It could be. Ooh. I'm small. I That's an animator. The animation? Ooh. Yeah. That's the only thing I can think of. The, reanim yeah, the, the reanimation wouldn't make sense. No. It's the animator. Thanks. Come on, more people. Give me another call. Come on. 
Put me in the ringer. Uh, one of these is just gonna be a phone call. It's like, yeah, I got wings and I love wine. <laughs> what am I? What am I, bro? Just give me the wine. Come on. Come on, dude. Call me from your weird soil universe and let's. Nice. What the guy's weird about? Oh, uh, that's Please a rain nymph. I guess. It's the only one I it's guess. A, it's a toilet pump. Oh, no, no, no. It's, wa it's talking specifically about the water in the sky. If it was like the water in the bowl or something, I'd be like, oh, yeah, that's my boy, the toilet hub. <laughs> I know who's got me. In fact, nobody's got me. I know the toilet hob's got me, dude. Because trust me, it's got to be the worst kind of hob to be, my dude. <laughs> Wait, what do they do? They live in your toilet and they just clean the toilet. Damn, dude, that's pretty sick. And you offer eggs to them. Oh, man. Please hold it. What the fuck could this one be? Uh, it could be the Dorsha. It could be the Horde. It could be cockroaches. Yeah, that one could be a lot, dude. It could be any of them. The thing, the key thing is that it's nuisance and pestilence. Those are typically cockroach traits, right? Rat. It's a rat. A whole ass rat? Harbinger of death is the Black Plague. Okay. Your past so, Mycin? Yeah, it's gotta be Mycin. Yeah, this is a video. Mice, mice, mice. Or cockroaches. I'd say that's mostly. Nah, Harbinger of death makes more sense based on how you explained it. The Black Plague was. Thanks. Rejoice. Rejoice. I'm passing my multiple choice test in order to become a tree or whatever these guys want. Come on, soil people, let's go. Get these phone calls rolling in. Uh, this. Seek the means of those who have too much step within, they lose their way. What am I? Shit. This could be a portal? Um. Lab closet labyrinth? It could be a closet labyrinth. That's the one, one I didn't read actually. Mm. Yeah, dude. The only ones that I can remember that are like uh uh what what's the word I'm looking for here? The only ones I can remember that are like step in and do the thing or something happens to you or like portal cellar grotto and uh this one kind of but i didn't read this one well enough mm -hmm. um what do you guys feel i'm liable to just pick this one i'm gonna close the labyrinth i'm gonna do it I'm gonna do this one. The other ones don't make much sense in comparison to what they've already said. Because the Cellar Grotto is like an offering stuff, but the portal doesn't want anything. So this is more of like a blind pick than anything. Yep, I guess we got it right or wrong. I, I don't know. But there we go. That's the speed I want. Please hold. Rise of the gardens who compel these, those who tread, no, tread to tread no longer. What are we? Avoid it. Um. So. What was the slow one? Mm, seedling? The only thing I can think of. The only thing I can think of is ceiling because all these other ones we've are don't. So the floor roots don't really aren't really soil things. The 
what do you call it? The um, these other ones, these false rosebush and flowers, they're not really plants or whatever. Ooh. I think this one makes sense because it's we are the companions of the gardens, and I remember seedlings were like, Yeah, don't mess with those weeds or we'll get you. Right. We're we're winging it. Fuck it. We're doing seedlings, boys. One of them seeds. Nice. Or not nice. I actually don't know. Am I doing it wrong? Am I doing it right? Who knows? Who can tell? Come on. Yep. Please hold. I am the forsaken oil and the careless light. What am I? Dancer bring it's finally, it's finally time. This is gonna be something with fire. House fires. Is it house fires? Yes, it's house fires. Yeah, because the forsaken well, oil and the um, careless light. Like they kill up people. No. Uh, nothing else here aside from the lamp spread is like fire, right? So. That's why. Guess we're doing it. Uh, house, house, house. What did the reckless do? Did they fucking cause the fire? Yeah. I consumed the weak and the reckless. That's so funny. Oh, now we're gonna descend. Well, we've just spent all this time ascending. Yeah, and like, what the fuck? I thought we were going up, not down, my dude. Make up your mind, weird fairy people. Yeah, weird soil wizards. Oh, <laughs> I know who that is, dude. Oh, it's me. It's your boy. The nameless. The big boy. Constantly talking about how he was seeking and delivering, dude. That's your boy, the Dorsha. Make peace with it now. <laughs> Dorsha on speed dial. The peace through acceptance or whatever the fuck they were talking about. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Can we descend a bit quicker, please? Quick. Okay. Oh. Oh, oh hi, Carol. Hello. <laughs> Carol's Carol got the contacts then. We've been watching you closely. For all this time, you have been providing excellent and accurate answers to our callers. Hey. These Yay. Yay. Her eyes turn green. And I'm pleased to report Ooh. that you have qualified for a promotion. 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 Thanks, Carol. Oh, oh Lord. Okay, I changed my mind. Changed my mind. I don't want the promotion. Please and thank you. Where is Mike? I want to be with Mike. 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 Hi. Uh, oh, Carol. Hello. What? Uh, it wasn't right. She was a fairy. Stupid ass fairies. <laughs> the video is like dying. Oh my God, <laughs> this is not cool. I don't think it's meant to be. What's my promotion? I don't know about the promotions. Oh, I promote to a fairy? Dude, I'm so sick of the fairies. I'm so sick of the fae. Nice. Good. Why? <laughs> I'm making it in light. That's a very fairy thing to do. To me. It's pretty funny. Do all this bullshit what? trial for a very small promotion. Yeah. Junior supervisor, dude. Hmm. 
<laughs> Can I go back to my desk now? Yeah, where's Mike? <laughs> can you undo Mike or something? Yeah, can you? I just want to see Mike. That's it. Thanks. All right. GG's. Great game. I hate fairies and I hate the Fae. And I hate cryptids and what what the hell is a Dorcha, dude? What is a Dorcha? Apparently it was like this inevitable monster or whatever who seeks and then delivers and the only solution for it was like make peace with, with, with find peace through acceptance that the Dorcha is just gonna get you. Mm -hmm. So um yeah, good game. <laughs> Funny ending, but good game. It's a good fits. Oh yeah, it's just a bunch of fairies fucking around in the woods, dude. Yeah. Ink. So the moral of the story, it's always a house fire. Yeah, or it's always Dorsha. <laughs>